I'm Keith, the guitarist in Revelation Days. I just want to thank you for listening. You know, the devil is real. His greatest accomplishment was to convince the world that he isn't. The Bible, in the book of James, chapter 4, verses 7 to 8, says, If we submit to God and resist the devil, he will flee. Draw close to God, and he will draw close to you. Now, Satan wants to tempt us into sin and rebellion against God and keep us there so that when we die, we'll be lost for eternity. And that is his only goal. For a long time, he did this to me, and I fell for it big time. My life was absolutely crazy. If I'd have died at that point, I would have been lost forever. But I repented, and I turned to Jesus. Now I thank God every day for saving me. Jesus said, Satan was the father of lies, and he came only to steal, kill, and destroy. Don't be a casualty. We're not promised tomorrow. God bless. Hello, I'm Jenny the singer with Revelation Days. The Bible in 1 Peter chapter 5 verses 8 to 9 says, Be sober, be vigilant, because your adversary the devil walks about like a roaring lion, seeking whom he may devour. Resist him steadfast in the faith. I have come to understand this scripture firsthand in my own life. Before I came to know Jesus as my saviour, the devil almost destroyed my life and for the first period of my Christian walk too. I had opened up all sorts of doorways to the devil in my life through my lifestyle choices and now I completely understand that the things God warns us not to do are never to just spoil our fun but are literally for our own protection. When we sin we give the enemy of our soul a legal right into our life and I found out this was the truth the very hard way. I wasn't taking the spiritual battle as seriously as I should and because I was living a compromised Christian life in many ways I had to go through many disasters, some with devastating results until I realised that spiritual warfare is not a game. When I finally surrendered my life fully to God and started getting my life lined up with his word I began to understand that the Bible is truly the living word of God and is as relevant today as it has ever been. I used to think the Bible was a dusty old book for religious people, but now my eyes have been opened to the awesome truth. I am so thankful that God has left us with the amazing gift of his word, which provides us with everything we need to live a victorious life and perfect wisdom on how to defeat the enemy through obedience to God. Today I'm the happiest and most fulfilled that I've ever been. I'm so grateful that God's love, mercy and patience has brought me to a place of true freedom. I can't describe in words how real the battle is for your soul. And whilst there is still time if you haven't already done so, please pray in Jesus' name and ask God to reveal the truth of who he is to you. If you ask with a sincere heart, he will. Then repent and ask for his forgiveness. Get yourself a Bible and start to read and ask God to help you understand. Find a good Bible-believing church and start to fellowship with your new family. Time is short. Please don't delay. God bless.